welcome you um, scorpions happy birthday happy birthday to all the scorpions who are having birthday in this week um this is for the week um, this week energy is actually your month energy this is what I said always ask for a reading so scorpions that are having birthday from the 11th of November until the 17th of November um, let's check out and see what's coming up for you guys I'm using the spiral deck so this is going to be a mystical year for you um, scorpions what is also happening is that you scorpions are dealing with organization you're going to be having balance in this year because you're having the energy of the um, air effect that is going to be watching over you okay so you scorpions who are having birthday November 11 until November 17 you are going to be having the air effect an organization that is watching over you some of you could be building your companies and starting your companies okay so ladies and gentlemen alrighty let's check out and see what exactly is coming in um this year for you guys is a balance year is a earth year for you guys um so this is going to be wonderful actually because it's it's as if some of you are bringing balance in your life okay so let's come look and see what's coming up for the people who were born on the 11th um you have the energy and let me get my glasses on for the people who were born on the 11th um, you are having the energy of the world so it's the completion of a cycle with a situation with an organization so whatever that was transpiring between you and the organization in this year there is a completion of this situation and as you notice this completion is in the upright position which is so powerful for the people who were born on the 12th you're dealing with justice so if you were born on the 12th of November justice come in and you're dealing um, with a situation you're balancing out the situation um, whatever the conflicts was whatever issues you were having with other people you're balancing out situations and an end is coming to a legal situation for some of you then we have the energy of the full and new start and this is going to affect every one of you um, that a new start is going to be coming in all right a new start is going to be coming in so for all who have, is born in this week, 11 until 17, a new start is definitely going to be coming to you. It is the crowning and the pinnacle of the top of your reading, okay? Whatever is up here and down here is what is going to be affecting you guys, okay? Then we have the energy of the star. I told you guys it's a beautiful year. Whatever is happening and transpiring is definitely, definitely a beautiful year that is coming in. I'm seeing a lot of you are going to be overcoming issues for the people who were born on um, 11 12 to 14 um, you have the magician beautifully beautiful alignment of energy and then we have uh, on the 16 we have the energy of the wheel of fortune I told you guys your year is just gonna be fabulous okay fabulous 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 and uh, um, here we go debt transformation for the people who were born under 17 okay but this is good because it's the end of something that has been happening in your life and a healing is going to be coming in so bam 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 okay I'm loving this for you um, scorpions please remember um, three readings so go back and look at your year reading last year and uh, um, check how the week when your birthday that week your birthday when your birthday fall in 2018 and 2017 and see if the energies as affect you because some of you are going to be realizing that the energy in 2000 and um, the energies in 2018 um affects you in 2017 or 2017 affects you so go back it's just three readings three readings is um 15 percent off three readings this is just so beautiful whatever is transpiring three readings is 15 percent off all three readings so all right um i'm seeing some of you communication needs uh, communication is the key okay communication is the key whatever that is happening and transpiring 
communication is going to be the key in this year to get through whatever is going on communication is the key in this year to get through whatever is going on speaking the truth um the kill chakra speaking the truth speaking the truth and that is definitely going to give you a new start i'm really loving this i decided to use this deck um for you guys and this is a, a new deck so you guys are the first one who are getting um being read from this deck and this is going to be good so let's get in it and see what is happening and how it is going to affect in you guys okay i said to you about a three hook a triangle whatever is in the top which is the three hook is a new start so I'll all of you once you were born 11 until the 17 all of you is going to be having a new start in something in your life okay and uh, sorry so it's true um then we have the people who are born under 16 this energy is going to affect the people on the 11 and 12 um, the 13 14 and 15 because you are going to be having some luck that is going to be coming into you some luck is definitely going to be coming into you then we have the energy of transition transition is going to be here the energy of transition is going to be here and what is happening what is the line is that as some things are going to be ending in your life and new things are going to be beginning now I'm just going to try this out with you guys because this is a new deck. I just, I, and I have um, a different deck, but I just want to use these new um, deck to see what is coming out. So let's see. We have the energy of the world. What is ending for the people who were born on the 11th? What is ending for the people who were born on the 11th? I'm seeing a deceptive situation. You have some regrets. A deceptive situation where you have some regrets so some of you um, were dealing with a cancer and this cancer has created some deceptive situation and you have some regrets okay um, really some regrets we're going to be looking what is going to be the outcomes so for the people who were born on the 11th um, we see that uh, you are walking away from this regret the deceptiveness you're planning it's finally come to an end because you were some of you were dealing with a cancer that have done some deceptive situation you had some regrets but you're saying and it doesn't have to be a cancer some of you just had um, some regrets about something now it is over and you are moving forward okay um, so whoever you are that was born on the 11th of um, of November what is transpiring and happening here is that I see that some deceptive situation and it is the four the four of cups is where you wish you had done things differently okay you wish you had done things differently and it's as if the universe is saying to you you know you have done your best okay so we can wish and we can go on and we can wish but the universe is saying to you you have done your best okay so that is what the the universe is saying so for the energy of the world what is coming out for the energy of the world because the universe some of you are still having some regret over situations some of you are going to think in this year oh let me leave it behind it's what is done is done you can't change what is happening so it can be a very emotional year for you guys but not to worry whatever is transpiring you have you have some conflicts in your life that you had some regrets about but it's okay you're dealing with it and you're going to be letting it go okay so you guys have four five uh, three four five and 21 three four five 21 and 11 three four five 21 and 11 so so your birthday is the 11th and you're going to be having some conflicts in this year but the conflicts is going to be over so 11 <laughs> 3 4 5 and 21 okay wow that is that is just so funny okay so for the people who were born on the 12th we have legal issues or a situation 
um, you weren't seeing something with a legal issue and it has to do with you young people, you young people between the ages of 18 and 45, there is some sadness. Um, whatever the situation is, is that you weren't seeing something clearly, you young people. And there is some sadness because you're dealing with a lot of anxieties and worries. You're dealing with a lot of anxieties and worries over an issue and a situation. It could have to be, um, deal with, um, um, it could have to deal with, uh, um, a Gemini. Okay. So some of you could have been having some issues with a Gemini or a Libran. Okay. A Gemini or a Libran or, um, whatever it could be issues, um, legal cost of the battle with your child. You weren't seeing something clearly. There could be legalities cost of the battle with a child, whatever the issue, the situation is, or was I'm seeing some sadness for some of you who have children. Okay. I'm seeing that some of you are worries to debt in this, but balance is going to be coming in. If you had issue with a, your child or a younger person, balance is going to come in because in this year, you're going to see clarity. Some of you, if you had a legal issue with a Gemini, you're going to be winning. Okay. If you had a legal issue with a Gemini, you're going to be winning. I'm seeing some of you who had a relationship with another um, air sign person, um, they're going to be so sadness. Here you go. I told you, I told you there is some winning that is coming up. So, um, whatever the issue is, and you were having some issue with a Gemini, I'm seeing you winning big. I'm winning big time. I'm seeing healing coming up for you and your child. I'm seeing balance coming in between you and whatever the worries was, whatever the issue was, whatever the situation was. You young people, you're going to be okay. Stop worrying because you're going to be passing. You're going to your exams. You're going to be passing your exams. You're going to be coming out. Careers are going to be good. So whatever you um, think that is not going to be resolved, um, it's going to be resolved. Okay. So this is good for the people who were born on the 12th. It's actually very beautiful for you people because what I'm seeing is that some unbalanced situation where some of you were worried, some of you wasn't sure about certain things. It was happening to the younger people and it could be happening to people who have their kids. They weren't seeing something clearly. Some of you weren't seeing something clearly, but this is going to be clear up and a balance is going to be coming in. So what is your number? Write this number down. You have... Uh, 11, 16, 8, 11, 16, and 8, 11, 16, and 8, okay? So let's look at the people um, who were born on the 13th. You have a new start, and this is wonderful. This is powerful. Some of you could be relocating. Some of you have a brand new start, whatever that was happening and transpiring is now resolved. A brand new start is coming in. Um, some of you could have a brand new start with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn, whoever this person is, this person is, um, between the age of 18 and 45. So whatever this is, you could be having a brand new start with this person. If you want it, this brand new start with this person could be coming in. And what else is there is that I'm seeing some of you standing your ground and protecting yourself, protecting your financial situation, protecting all that you have. I'm seeing you really standing up for yourself. You're learning to stand up for yourself. And this is very, very good because what was transpiring was that you guys who were born on the 13th, you're getting a brand new start. Okay. A very brand new start. And this start is going to change everything for you because whoever this young person is, you're protecting yourself from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. Now, whoever this person, however, this person comes up, it could be a partner. Um, you could be protecting this person also, but it could be your partner, whoever this person and whatever is transpiring. I'm seeing a good year coming up for you because some of you could be having new starts with as, as, um, uh, uh, a Sagittarius. Some of you, um, could be having new starts with your siblings. Let's say that there was some problems with your, you and your sisters and brothers or, a past partner. I'm seeing, um, you're having some good new start with siblings. I'm seeing business. If you want to go in business is a yes. Um, business is going to go, go good. If you want to go in business, it's, 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 it's absolutely fabulous. It's a good year. 
I'm seeing wonderful swords. Some of you are going to be connecting with an Aquarius. I'm seeing sisters and brothers coming back together. But I'm, I'm, I'm seeing if you're going in a relationship, you're going to be protecting yourself, okay? But I'm seeing you are letting back people in your life, but you're like, okay, I got to protect myself. And there's nothing wrong with that, okay? So you have, and you're working with nine, so something is going to be ending that is going to be giving you a brand new start. So all you young people, whatever that is happening and transpiring, definitely a brand new start is coming in. If some of you had issues with your kids, um, or you're looking for a new start. Yes, it is going to be happening in this year. It is going to be a very positive year because I'm seeing also money is coming in uh, slowly but surely. Money is coming in. I'm seeing you protecting your money and your financial stability. I'm seeing you protecting kids. Some of you might be pregnant with um, a kid. This kid is going to be coming in as a crystal kid. Okay. All right, let's move to the people who were born on the 14. You have the energy of the star. Um, hold on. Yeah, nine. Um, nine. You know, it's, it's going back to the people who were born on the 13. Brilliant situation. Brilliant things is going to be happening for you. Now, some of you are dealing with an air sign. Some of you are not seeing something about an Aquarian. If you're in a relationship with an Aquarian, I'm seeing that you're going to be finding out the truth. If you think that there was some hidden, um, is an Aquarian, but a Libra and an Aquarian. If, if you think that there was some hidden mistress about this person, yes, it is. You're going to be finding out and cutting this person off. Okay. Yes, you're going to be finding out and you're going to be cutting this person off. You're going to be finding out um, something especially you men 45 years and older is going to be finding out something about a Libran or something about an Aquarian. Some of you I'm seeing you men are going to be clearing up some issues. I'm seeing you whatever legal issues that is coming up that you're going to be able to deal with these legal issues. And this is going to be good. Okay. So, um, whatever is happening and transpiring um you have the energy of the star and the energy of the star is that elin is coming in so if you were born on the 14th of november oh my god it's a happy birthday <laughs> oh it's my um it's my um my godchildren father birthday oh my god the 14th <laughs> okay so here we go you men 45 years and older, big 50, happy birthday, because I know you're watching me. <laughs> you're watching me on English, the English channel. Okay, so you men, whatever legal issues, whatever situation, whatever that was going on, happy birthday. It's going to be a beautiful year for you men, especially you men 45 years and older. There's going to be a healing. There's going to be positive alignment for energy. Enjoy and whatever that you weren't seeing, the mysteries, it's going to be a very mysterious year for you people that was born on the 14. Congratulations. Happy big 50th. I'm right behind you. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. That's my, um, so enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Let's see what else is coming out for you guys. Ooh, there is a third party. Uh, there is some jealousy and for some of you men you're going to be finding out that there's someone else oh 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 there's a lot of jealousy coming up at, at uh, um, for some of you a lot of jealousy but some of you men could be finding out if you thought that there was something very mysterious about an Aquarian or a Libran yeah, they there could be a third party. Um yep. Oh yeah. There is a third party. You could be finding this out, okay? All right, let's move on. If you want a personalized reading, please connect with me. All right, your numbers for the people who were born on the 14th two. Uh, 17, um, eight, two, 17, eight and another seven. Okay. All right. Let's move on to the people who 
let's move on to the people who were the magician. The magician comes out for the people um, who are uh, who was born on the 15th. This is good. Whatever you decide to do in this year, yes, go ahead. This is going to be a good year for you guys, okay? Whatever you were deciding to do in this year who were born on the 15th, it's a yes. Go ahead, go ahead. I'm seeing um, uh, if you're starting a business, um, new business idea, new positive energy is coming in. Yes, 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 go for it. Whatever is transpiring, yes, go for it. If you want to start a new business, change your job. Yes, go for it. Lies and deception is going to be coming out. People who are born 15 of November, a whole lot of lies and deception is going to be coming out about money. Some of you are going to be finding out some serious deceptiveness about money. Be aware, you people who were born on the 15, lies and deceptiveness about money. It's all going to come out, okay? all gonna come out um, this uh, yeah there is gonna be a theft of money you're going to be finding out something about a theft of money be aware of this because it's going to be coming out for you guys some theft of money um, it's gonna be coming out um, it's 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 gonna be coming out but you will receive the money it's a huge theft of some money that has uh, uh, has happened and it has to do with uh, a Gemini Okay, this is the energy of a Gemini. Some of you who are dealing with a Gemini in business or some situation that has to do with a Gemini, huge theft of money um, that has transpired. You could be finding it out for the Gemini or the Gemini uh, um, I've done it to you, is vice versa. Okay, so your numbers is going to be 1, 10, which is 1, so it's 11. Ah, three times one. There is transition for you guys. A theft, a huge theft that some of you are going to be finding out. Okay, so be aware of that. We're looking at the people who are born on the 16th. You have the wheel of fortune for the people who are born on the 16th. I am seeing the king of swords, um, where something was found out. And um, I'm seeing that some of you are going to be in the spotlight, and this is good. A wheel of fortune with three of pentacles. A lot of you are going to be in the spotlight. I'm seeing people realizing something that whatever you're doing is very good. I see that people are going to be connecting with you. You're in the spotlight in this year. And the wheel is as if luck is going to be coming in. I'm seeing some of you cutting through, making things happen for yourself. So this is going to be good. People are going to be cutting through, making sure that things happen for them. This is good because once you were born on the 15th, the 16th of November, you have the wheel of fortune. You're going to be very lucky in this year. The spotlight is going to be on you. I'm seeing communication, positive communication coming to you. Okay. What else are you dealing with? Um, a, a something to do with a book. Um, some of you, if you have written a book, it is time to publish that book. Some of you, some secret comes out and you are going to be receiving help because whatever it could be. Some of you that is, ha, um, have a book or it's going to be writing a book or it's going to be bringing out some information, some secret information that was not aware. So I'm seeing a one, 10 and three, one, 10 and three is going to be your, your number and 26, one, 10, three, 26 and eight, one, 10, three, 26 and eight. And for the last person who was born on the 17th, we have transition coming in. Don't worry about this card. This is your energy vibration. You're just ending some shit. You're just really, really ending some shit that is happening in your life. You're definitely cutting off things, ending some shit that has happened in your life. Okay. So don't worry about the transition. You have a lot of opportunities. So you're ending something. You people who were born on the 17th, a lot of opportunities are going to be coming true. Transition is coming in for you. Whatever the situation that is happening and transpiring, I'm seeing you ending situation, but yet still opening up doors of opportunities and doors of opportunities. I told you 
some of you are going to be reconnecting with um, a lady this lady is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn whoever this lady is it could be your mom that you're reconnecting with some of you could be going um, on a, a quest um, some of you could be marrying this person because I'm seeing a transition is coming up and um, it's as if this person is going to be opening up a lot of doors and opportunities for you because this woman I've seen like uh, something has transpired in your life and this person is going to be healing and making sure that doors of opportunities open up in your life so a transition is coming um, I'm not seeing it as the death of your mom or something like that but I'm seeing as the end of something there are some dark clouds so what is happening is that some of you um, your parents you could find out that your mom is ill in this year so be aware of that because um, but the illness is or if you yourself is is not feeling well it's going to be getting better as you get out of this year so this is wonderful it's positive it's good it's positive alignment from energies that is coming in these are wonderful positive energies so um, enjoy I'm a scene six seven six seven thirteen and four six seven thirteen and four wow it's gonna be a beautiful 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 year a be very beautiful year for you guys um whatever is happening and transpiring I'm seeing beauty coming in um for you guys and that uh, this is going to be good I am seeing really beauty coming in for you guys and this is going to be good so whatever the issues the situation is I'm seeing beauty coming in for you guys and it's going to be good okay Ooh, la, la. Uh -huh. all righty so it's just breed just breed just breed just breed ladies and gentlemen just breed whatever is happening don't take it serious just breed ladies and gentlemen whatever is happening just breed it's going to be okay don't take things serious this year because it's going to be a beautiful year please remember to share 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 these videos okay it's all about communication it's all about breeding it's all about being who you want to be it's all about there it's going to be a very positive year please like and share 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 put on your notification buttons remember um the quarter readings the year readings and uh 2020 and the month of january is coming up um any three readings 15 percent off but you have to all the three readings okay i'm making it easier for you guys this is all for you guys so I love you guys. I am saying namaste until next time.